Have you ever wondered about the mysteries shrouding the short life and death of the young Pharaoh Tutankhamun? Nestled in the heart of the ancient Egyptian desert lies his resting place, a treasure trove of artifacts and gold discovered by Howard Carter in 1922. Yet, beneath the golden splendor, profound enigmas persist. Questions about Tutankhamun's life, rule, and untimely demise have captivated and puzzled historians and researchers for decades. Let's embark on a journey to unveil the secrets of this young pharaoh's life and death. At the heart of the mystery lies the golden mask of Tutankhamun. Its exquisite craftsmanship goes beyond the known skills of the time, suggesting the hand of an undiscovered master artisan. This resplendent artifact, capturing the timeless essence of regality, veils more than the face of the young pharaoh. It raises compelling questions about the identity of its creator and the advanced techniques used in its creation. This mask, hiding more than just the pharaoh's face, continues to baffle us with its unsolved mysteries. The hieroglyphics adorning the walls of the tomb narrate the tale of a young ruler thrust into power unexpectedly. As if caught in a storm, Tutankhamun's ascension to the throne was sudden, raising many brows. The circumstances remain shrouded in mystery, with whispers of political maneuvering echoing through the corridors of time. The royal court, a theater of power plays and intricate intrigues, adds layers to the enigma of Tutankhamun's reign. The walls whisper tales of power and intrigue, adding to the enigma of the boy king. Among the treasures, a small ornate dagger poses a puzzle that perplexes researchers. This dagger, composed of meteoric iron, was a material not native to Egypt, raising questions about how it was obtained. Its existence suggests an advanced understanding of metallurgy, previously unknown within the constraints of ancient Egypt. Was this celestial metal a gift from afar, or did the Egyptians possess a secret technique to harvest it? This celestial dagger, a testament to a knowledge far beyond its time, deepens the mystery surrounding Tutankhamun. The cause of Tutankhamun's premature death remains one of the most enduring mysteries. Modern forensics have been able to peer back through the millennia, examining the young pharaoh's remains with an accuracy unimaginable in the early days of Egyptology. The initial theories of murder, once rife amongst historians, have been challenged. Instead, it has been suggested that an infected leg wound degenerating into a fatal case of gangrene might have been the cause of the boy king's untimely demise. Yet even with these scientific advancements, the mystery persists. Was the wound accidental or was it inflicted intentionally? Could it have been a result of an assassination attempt or a symptom of an unknown disease? The answers to these questions remain as elusive as the shifting desert sands. The sands of time continue to keep the secrets of Tutankhamun's death tantalizingly out of reach. The whispers of a bygone era echo in the tomb of Tutankhamun, holding on to the secrets of his life and death. The enigmas of his golden mask's craftsmen, his unexpected rise to power, the celestial dagger's origin, and the cause of his premature death continue to perplex us. Yet, within these mysteries lie the allure of this young pharaoh. As we continue to unravel the mysteries of the enigmatic pharaoh Tutankhamun, we are left in awe of the intricacies of his life that transcend the boundaries of history.